a look at one of the, I think it was the first wave of 09 figures for the Legend Reborn movie. Of course, with Matt and Nui, um, a car here. One of, one of my favorites, if not my favorite from that wave, of course, we had Matt and Nui, we had Tina, um, Gresh. It's either between him and Gresh, between who's my favorite, honestly, I'm not too sure. Nostalgia Kid's very hard for this guy. I remember getting him... I wanted to say for Christmas or something, but I thought he was Summer Wave, so I, I I don't I don't know anymore. That was years ago. Again, 2009. Gosh, that was a long time ago. But figured might as well take a look at a car while I have a semi-decent one here. We got some crack joints. At least one crack joint, which I guess we'll end up checking out the other ones in... See how broken he is, but uh, let's take a quick look. Ooh, a car. He, I don't have the Spinax shooter, whatever the heck they were calling those at that time, that you plugged in here, but low ball, you shot. Literally every figure had one from 09. Now, the main attraction to him, the Fire Sword. They later reused this fire piece right here, made it a better color, reused it for the Stars Tahu right after this wave, which, honestly, I kind of forgot about that Stars line, like some other people, even though I actually do really like it compared to some other people. But compared to some of the other wave, or some of his other wave mates, um, I love the Fire Sword. It just, it worked out great. Um, it looks great. New Fire Piece, which... I really wish we could have gotten more uses of that. I mean, yeah, it really only works for fire, but still kind of sucks. You know, Bionicle was canceled right after that. Who knows what else we could have gotten with that piece. So, accessories. Decent, all right. Um, now, also, for anybody who remembers, there was that game you could play. Nobody ever played it. I didn't know a single person that played it or knew how they played it. Pretty sure it wasn't online. Or something else I'm thinking of. I have no idea. Just everybody had all these lying around. And we don't use them for anything. They're just for looks at this point. Sorry for the camera shaking. It is not attached. A very secure way to the desk here. Um, but basic 09. Well, he was not the basic Anaga frame. Technically, well, actually, never mind. Pulling out um, basically the first Anaga here have some differences of course the torso the heads actually was given hands i was thinking they changed some pieces but no basically a complete copy of motoro here which in my opinion is one of the better ones definitely improved it with the car um they tried doing something really cool given these spikes here on the shoulders now with that you can see the blue which isn't the prettiest and also, you're not going to get... I guess that's decent range, but they get caught a lot, the spikes, trying to articulate them and stuff. So I know a bunch from... You, you can tell which were my childhood ones, just from them being bent down in a bin in the Lego room, in the Bionicle weapons bin. So, I, I don't know. It was a cool idea. I think they executed it, honestly, as well as they could have, but it's semi-annoying nothing really you can do about it but they, they do look cool we'll admit that so was a nice use for that piece especially in orange i think this was our first time getting that piece in orange do we even get it i know we got it in orange and power miners besides that i'm not sure we actually got that piece in orange at all articulation again it said standard and like a body so ball joint here have the hinge here ball joint at the hands ball joint at the head ball joint at the top of the leg here again the leg here which can you go far forward the knee does these are my favorite um and i get knee pieces they look great um i think most people will agree with that they get do get caught on the shoulder pad there a little bit but you don't i don't like them forward the whole way so it works out pretty good on him uh, ball joint at the feet. So, articulation is very average. I mean, well, by average, I mean it's good. It's by, it's, you know, it's Bionicles. You're not going to get, it's, it's not like an action figure where you're going to get a butterfly joint here or 
you know, waist movement at this time. They didn't have waist movement. It wasn't designed set up that way, like 2015, 2016 waves. Did they even do it in the 2015 wave? No, it was until 2016 or whatever. But yeah, articulation, still one of the better ones. It's just this shoulder up here that does get caught that hinders the articulation. Besides that, articulation is pretty good on this guy. And we did end up getting this in blue for, I can't remember his name, even though I have what, five copies of him. But very nice headpiece here. Um, of course, you know, gonna be the orange and red for the fire colors. Um, it's decent, but I, it was definitely very different not covering the whole mask piece here, even pulling, again, Matoro out, which it was pretty different. Um, the back was this big green piece and they stuck a rubber piece on it. But you can tell the whole mask covered his face and Ricardo's does it. And it, it was definitely very unique, something to get used to, something very different. Um, definitely grown on me. It looks great with the head. Headpiece was great. Used Hero Factory. Used all kinds of places. So, definitely grown on me. For some size comparisons. Here he is besides that Matoro that I keep pulling out. Who I think is actually a little bit taller. And I'm not sure if that comes from the bigger head or not. But Matoro... The Star Wars Buildable Finn, who I am expecting to be taller, even though a car was one of the bare ones from the wave. Finn there, which, besides the a car here, Finn definitely stands out. Um, yeah, definitely like a car a lot more. And then besides uh, Matt Nui here, who's also in the wave, and of course, you know, the main character of the movie, blah, 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 but looks great beside each other. Um, need to get a rebuild, complete, whatever, somehow I need to get the rest of the wave. Here is a quick rundown of a car. Very good figure. One of the best from that, uh, original 2009 wave. And I do want to say on this copy, so there's a bro- Okay, so yeah, a lot more joints are broken on this than I thought, which, you know, is expected, but still- very good Bionicle figure. If you don't have them, I'd recommend them. Just a very good one. He'll stand out on the shelf with the colors, the reds, the oranges. He'll look great. Again, the only thing that stands out on him, technically in a bad way, is the blue pins here. But what are you going to do about that? So there he is. If you have him, had him, whatever, blah, blah, blah. Let me know what you think about him, what you thought of the 2009 wave. But thanks for watching. Stay tuned and see you in the next one.